Are you live? Hi guys! I am live here at Kill Wins. We are getting ready to show you guys something special. I'm gonna introduce you to the lovely Janelle. She's gonna walk you guys through the Kill Wins and we gonna show y'all what I'm getting ready to try. Here she go right here, the lovely Hi. Janelle. She's so wonderful, she's so sweet. We gonna, no, before I come here, I'm just gonna, I've been here long enough, so I kinda know everything. You got all oh, the wonderful treats. Oh, the wonderful te pecan snappers, cashew snappers. Oh my God, Oreos. Oh, they're so good. Look at all of this. Mm. Look at this, guys. Look at that. Oh my God. I love them. You got so much wonderfulness right here. Y'all ain't ready for all of the chocolates. Chocolates are so good. But Miss Janelle is going to show y'all some of their wonderful, delicious, my favorite thing here, their wonderful, beautiful apples. Janelle, let's take it away. Hi, Tell them a little bit about the apples. Hi, yes. So, our Kilwins apples are made with our homemade caramel. It is a two and a half hour process. We really take our time to make it to perfection. And we use green Granny Smith apples, and they're really nice and juicy and sour. So the sour with the sweet is like the perfect combination, which makes our apples absolutely phenomenal. Oh. We can't even keep these on the shelves. We went from making them like every other day to now we have to literally make them every day just for you all, because you all have been amazing. And of course, because they're really good. Yes. So, um, I'm actually making Jeremy two of our most popular, our signature turtle. It is the green gray with apple with our homemade caramel with pecans drizzled in chocolate. And so I'm going to show you all the process oh. of making it. The oh, y'all, she about to do it. Man, listen. I so. have my little, whatever you want to call this here, my piping bag. Look at this, y'all. Look at that. Oh my God! I'm getting my chocolate in my piping bag. Y'all, I'm up. not ready for this. Look at that chocolate! Ooh. Ooh! How do you stay so thin and in shape with all this chocolate? Honestly, I get this question all the time, and the answer is genetics is really like holding <laughs> me up right now. So like, I'm getting a little older. So I gotta slow down, but when I tell you, you would have thought I would be sick of all this stuff, like smelling it and seeing it and eating it every day, but Never. I don't, I don't know. It just hasn't happened for me yet. I'm awaiting the day where I get sick of it, but so far, no luck. Woo, there we I'm go. Gonna cut a oh, they got some strawberries too. Don't get it twisted, y'all. Uh -oh. uh oh. So now this is my favorite part. I'm just gonna take the stick and then. Oh, y'all, look at that. Oh, man. I'm gonna reverse it. And that right there, ladies and gentlemen, is our turtle apple. Oh. Woo. Oh my God, look at that. Y'all, you ain't have these apples? And while she do this other one, I'm gonna go ahead and head over there so y'all can see some of the caramel process. Excuse me, look. <laughs> y'all, I'm sorry, I'm a, little, I'm a little thick. Look, check this out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Y'all ain't ready. So, here you see the green apples. And now, ooh, my man's with the plan. What's going on? What's going tell him, on? Tell him what you, tell him, tell him what you making here. We're making caramel right now. We're making them for these lovely apples. We're gonna be making some more streakers over here. Mm. I heard you guys were looking at bear claws and snappers. We're making some of those today too. Making a big batch of caramel, about 25 pounds. Look at that. Now how long does this caramel have to sit? Well, it's not caramel sits. It's about, it cooks for about, about two hours roughly, a little bit less. So do you start that thing the whole two hours? The whole time. So what happens if you don't stir it right? It's gonna start to crack up on the sides, uh -huh. and then it's gonna turn brown, and then the caramel, instead of it being soft, it's gonna be hard as a rock. And then it's gonna damage our teeth. Exactly. And then we ain't gonna be able to go to the doctor no more. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, this is my man, look at that. It was, oh, no, I can't tell you what this is, this is special. Okay. This is special liquid that goes to the caramel. Special ingredients. Ooh! That's it, it's so, y'all. So if you haven't been to Kill Wins, 
make sure you guys come check them out. They actually have their fudge slices for Blacktober this weekend. So you can come get your special. But, and they specials change every weekend. So don't feel afraid. Come up here. Come visit the one in High Park. You're going to love it. It's so wonderful, so sweet. Janelle, you want to tell them anything last words before we get out of here? I just want to say thank you to Jeremy of Black Will Eats for always being so awesome. Thanks you guys for being so awesome. And yes, come to Kilwins where everything is made, handmade, right before your eyes.